Hey everybody, this is your girl Bree from Bree's Kitchen. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How y'all tonight? Today or to even, depending on how what time you're watching this video. On today's show, Bree will show you how to make fried chicken tenders. That's what I'm having today for my dinner. Fried chicken tender with box macaroni cheese. And this is the box. Okay. I like to do it easy sometimes, y'all. I really do. I like to be easy sometimes. But if you follow my page, you'll also see the recipe on how to make homemade macaroni cheese as well. But with the box macaroni cheese, all only thing you're going to do is boil your water, put a little salt to keep your noodles from sticking together, as well as you can use a little butter or oil, okay? Because that's, that's what I use. That's what I use, you guys. I'll use a little boil, a little oil, and just a little salt in the water. Okay? So, with that being said, let us go ahead and get started on these wonderful, wonderful chicken tenders that I sliced and diced myself. <laughs> and, y'all, you know, you go, I'm a, it's so easy. If you don't know how to season chicken... Where have you been? Where you been? Okay, because this is not hard. Black pepper, store brand. I told you guys, I'm always about saving money. You can use a little seasoned salt or and a little garlic powder and onion powder if that's what you like. You can use whatever season that you like. That's what I use for my chicken tenders. Okay, so I've already got my deep fryer heating up 350 degrees. Okay, when I tell y'all, I'm cheap. I don't buy no special bowl of flour. Guess what I'm using? It was an old whipped cream bowl. Yup, sure is. That's what I'm using. Okay, now before I get started, let me wash my hands because I was just pushing my hair out of my face. Let me wash my hands real quick, you guys. Okay. I washed my hands and now I'm going to get ready to drop my chicken tenders, okay? Like I said, I've already got my deep fryer heated up to 350 degrees, okay? I'm going to take my flour as well as my beautiful, beautiful chicken tender. I'm going to go ahead and drop it in the grease, you can, you can cover it up as much as you want, but make sure that you guys shake some of the excess flour off of your chicken, okay? Because we want it floured well, but we don't want to eat flour, okay? Because I know some people, honey, they be, I be like, okay, you gonna knock some of that flour off that chicken? See, here we go again. You see how it is nicely covered. And you also find some people will season their flour. I don't like I don't like to do mine like that. I don't do mine like that. But you can if that's what you like, you're more than welcome to do that. I'm just saying I don't like doing it. Okay? Cuz to me that's like wasting flour. Because to me like different meat that I cook, I use different seasoning. Okay, so I don't want to ever just mix up my my flour with all these different seasonings. And one thing about when you deep fry, you guys, you can put as much as you want in there. And it all going to still cook evenly. Okay, how y'all doing today? Y'all, let me say, I, I guess I'm going to say it there when we eat dinner tonight. We just got to talk, you guys. I want to know how you guys been. Leave me a comment down at the bottom. Okay. I'm doing, I'm flowering my last one now. Oh, no, hold on, wait a minute. I think I can put another one in there. Yeah, I'm going to put another one in there. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to drop it in the grease. 
okay? Let me wash my wash some of this flour off my hand. Okay. All right, now I just washed the flour off my hand. I'm going to get ready. I'm dropping my grease now. I mean, I'm dropping the chicken now. Okay. Ooh, can y'all hear it? Can y'all hear it? Let me cover up my chicken. I'm covering up my chicken now, you guys. And my noodles are cooking as well. Okay, this is going to be one of those real quick, easy meals. Okay, a really easy meal. I'm let you guys see how this. Let you guys see how it's cooking. Y'all want to see? Can y'all see? Me? <laughs> I don't know if y'all really got it. Hey, everybody, this is your girl Bree. I'm back with a finished meal. Okay, I got my dinner rolls as well as my carrots, my chicken tender, and my macaroni cheese. And like you, I always tell you guys, my meal is never complete without a bottle of Pepsi. Okay. Y'all, I am so hungry. Let me say my prayer real quick so I can chow down. Come join me. Sit at my table and eat with me. Father, God, I ask that you bless this food that I'm not to receive. Let me be eat and be satisfied. Thank you in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. Yes, you guys, I, you already know my meal is never complete without my Pepsi. Oh, Lord, my phone. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know, honey. I love my own. I loves my Pepsi. Okay, I do. I really do. I love my Pepsi, y'all. I do. Um, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to get everything. Well, I was trying to get everything together. Hold on, you guys. I'm sorry. I do apologize. apologize you guys <sighs> no not my blinds are all crazy yes y'all I am so hungry I am so ready to get my eat on how y'all doing how y'all doing man when I tell y'all this food is looks so delicious who want to take the first bite? Me or you? I'm so hungry. I don't know if I want to share. But I'm going to do it anyway. Here you go, you guys. Did you like it? You like it? You like it? Okay. My turn. Oh, yes, y'all. I love me some carrot. Seen carrot with a little butter in it? Oh, my goodness. And, of course, the macaroni cheese. Y'all, this is ridiculous. This is so crazy. Yes, y'all, you know I have to have my Pepsi. Y'all, can I tell y'all what's been going on on my end? Y'all ready? Man, Defoe's been working us like crazy. I've been working like crazy, you guys. Mm. And these are my chicken tenders. Do y'all like barbecue sauce? My barbecue sauce. Do y'all like barbecue sauce with y'all chicken tender? I normally make my own sauce. Mm. 
Oh yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I use I'll use when I'm making my own sauce, I use my own honey mustard as well as my own barbecue sauce. But you guys, like I was telling y'all earlier, in order to make your chicken tender, season it in the way that you like it. If you like your flour season, flour that way. And if you want to flour the chicken too, that's fine. The only reason why I don't do it is because I cook different things. And different with the different meats that I cook, I like to use different seasons. So to me, that's like wasting flour. I and mean, I already told y'all, I'm cheap. I'll be trying to save everything I have. <laughs> but heat your um, deep fryer 350 degrees. And let the deep fry do its thing. And you guys, and if you want to see any more of my recipes, make sure you like and subscribe if you're interested. If you want to see how Breeze Kitchen makes her cake, her treats, the candy spoons, the, the, the cake pops, the onesie pops for baby shower, the baby shoes, sweets, pies, desserts, and meal. If you want to see how I do it, follow my page, you guys. And not only just on YouTube, I'm on TikTok, Facebook, as well as Instagram. Mm-hmm. So I'm everywhere. Trust me. Y'all, I love these general. Mm, 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 mm. But yeah. And you know what you got? I'm going to tell y'all something else too. When I started this YouTube channel, when I tell you, and I'm just being honest, when I started this YouTube channel, I did not know what I'm doing. And I still don't know what I'm doing. I'm learning as I go. So, um, you might see different sides of me because I'm trying to, also at the same time with all the different things that I do, I'm just trying to find my niche and what people are really interested in. Okay. So to you, it may seem like I'm all over the place and sometimes I I might do because you will see different types of videos that I make. But like I said, you guys, I'm still learning and I'm not ashamed to say that. I'm still learning. I don't have a lot of views. And, but I mean, I, I have a lot of views. My bag, I'm so sorry. I have a lot of views. I have over 10,000 views but not a lot of subscribers and i don't know why and so i'm not gonna be honest with you guys did that bother me yes because i was sitting here like okay well maybe this is not for me you know i'm trying to handle so many social media pages and i'm like maybe this is not for me but then i was like i love doing it because it's also helped me to be able to be out in front of the camera and still talk you know what i'm saying because i'm one of those people that like if i don't know you i won't say anything to you and so with me doing this, I could tell from the beginning when I started, man, I was so shy. And I couldn't even understand why I'm shy. I'm like, I'm in my own house, but I'm, I was still shy. So now, even though I don't have as many subscribers right now, and I know that's going to change. I was still just trying to figure it out. And I didn't know, like, when I was doing my research to do YouTube, it, you know, I was you hearing that. You know, whatever that you do, and if you get a lot of views off that, and then stick with it. So my first video was when I really became serious as far as my um YouTube channel was the fried strawberry video. And it was just a video that I, I made from TikTok. Pew, shot to eight. That thing, you know, I get the copyright, copyright, copyright. And I'm like, how? Why am I getting copyright? I and mean, this is what people do on TikTok. I was like, oh my God. So now that I know that, I just won't do any more music. Anybody music anyway. Oh, okay, that's gonna solve that part. Mm-hmm. I couldn't believe it, y'all, because I kept wondering. 
And we, and I know there's a lot of people like me that may want to do a channel and don't know how. Because I promise you I don't know how. I'm just going with the flow. And that's when I said, you know what, y'all? That's when I stopped trying to figure out, like, trying to be, do it this way and that way. And I'm like, shoot, just do it. You're going to learn regardless. You're going to learn the do that it don't in the process. Because if you sit here and just constantly keep waiting, you're right. You would never get nowhere. You will always be in the beginning stage. You're going to always be in the beginning stage. And you don't want that. Because for a while, I had stopped posting videos. I was like, man, wait a minute. What is going on? But I love, I really love doing it. I really do. And I'm like, you, I'm sitting here talking to y'all like you are in my house. Literally, like you're in my house. So, that's what I did, y'all. So, don't be scared. And I can say that, I don't know, you like, I just want to say this, you don't even have a lot of subscribe because I can. I can say it because I was there, I was where you were. And you never know. You can get, you can go viral overnight and not even expect it. And even with me, it wasn't so much that I was trying to get to go viral. I don't even know how to go viral. I'm just doing me. I eat every day. I cook. I, I cater people party and stuff like that. I just never recorded it, you know? So, I've, everything that you see me doing, I've been doing it. This is not something that I'm doing for YouTube. I'm not, you know, on what I'm doing for YouTube is putting it on YouTube. But, baby, I eat every day. You will see, you will see me and my kids eating every day. Every day. So, this is not nothing new to me. I'm not doing this for YouTube. I'm just using YouTube. To put it out there because this is what I do. I got to eat. I work. I got to eat. I got to cook. I got a family. I have people that order stuff. So. That's what I do, y'all. I eat, homie. Y'all, when I tell you this is so good. This is really, really delicious. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm-hmm. Y'all, my head is too solid in my face. Mm-hmm. Y'all. I'm trying not to drink no soda right now. I'm just one. Oh, I'm just enjoying. This is so good and it's seasoned so well. I love garlic powder and onion powder, y'all. I love it. Mm, 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 mm. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. But that's what y'all got to do. You just got to do it, honey. Whatever it's going to be, it's going to be. And what's meant for you is meant for you. Ain't nobody else. Or you can research all you want. You're still not going to know. You're going to look at other people's pages. And that ain't going to do nothing but intimidate you and discourage you because you're looking at Dawn. I'm doing the same thing they're doing. But how I'm not getting, why well, I'm not getting interviews like that? The thing is, you don't know how long they've been doing it. You know, I don't know anything about um, editing videos, y'all. I just do the best I can. And the best is what you're getting. And that's just being honest. Mm -hmm. You're not going to know. And whoever tells you all, oh, yeah, you can research. You can research till you're blue in the phone.
I take this as like, okay, say if you're driving, you're doing your driver test. How you're going to, no matter how much you practice and you study the book, some of the questions you would never know if you've never done it. You know what I'm saying? So you will learn as you begin to do it. So it will mean you guys, I know I'm going to learn as I continue to do it. But right now, what you see is what you get. Hello. Period. <laughs> period, boo. That's what my daughter be saying. Period, boo. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, that's what I say, y'all. Y'all see my ice on top. I put too much ice in here. And I can't even put my top on. <laughs> but yeah. Y'all, I just got to step out there and do your thing. Because I promise you would never know. You don't. And even with me, you know, my thing was, I said, okay, there's so many people. I don't do hair. You know, I don't do makeup. I do my makeup, but I don't do, I can't give you a tutorial on how to do makeup and how to do hair. If I did it, everybody going to look like me. Now everybody going to wear their makeup the way I wear mine. And everybody don't like to wear their, wear their makeup the way I wear mine. So I couldn't do that. I don't sew, you know, and I cook. That's what I do. I cook. I create different meals. That's what I'm doing. I'll take old school candy and turn into something new. A Jolly Rancher is a Jolly Rancher all day long. But who wants to eat a Jolly Rancher candy bar the same way years after years after years? So let's figure out how we can make this Jolly Rancher still be Jolly Rancher, but in a different way. Excuse me. That's what I do. Turning old school candy into something new. That's why you see the Jolly Rancher shot glasses. The Jolly Rancher's candy shape. You know what I'm saying? So I turn old school candy into something new. That's me. Mm-hmm. That's what I do, y'all. So, y'all... I bet y'all didn't believe that I ate all that food. My plate is so clean and I am so full. On that note, glad that y'all tune in. And remember, like me, if you're interested in learning how to turn old school candy into something new, taking old school candy and creating different items to drink, from drink to dessert, subscribe to my channel, Breeze Kitchen. Make sure your notification bell is turned on. So you will be notified each and every time I upload a video. Not only am I on YouTube, I'm on TikTok, Facebook, as well as Instagram, Breeze Kitchen. Okay. Until later, you guys.